one who fears the Lord is to be praised. We keep receiving blessings. Welcome to feeling messes. Morning guys, it's Saturday and you vlog. Well, it is Saturday. It is two, three o'clock in the morning. I am up and ready to go to the airport. Um, I just wanted to come and start off the vlog before we forget. Welcome to a new vlog. Um, like, subscribe, turn on your post notification. Like, me tired, me tired, me tired, me tired. Yeah, but I am up and ready to go to the airport. Um, hopefully I reach in time. Where well, my flight is. 5.40, we have a hour and a half to get there. We are in check in, we just have a carry-on. So hopefully we get a smooth ride over and I can get my flight. So yeah, stay tuned for the rest of the vlog guys. Comment down below, like, subscribe, share, tell a friend, tell another friend, tell another friend, we come over here, so yeah. <laughs> Turn left onto Airport Road, then turn left onto Airport Drive. Arrived. This woman with flowers. When Lloyd went, when look at that. Okay, so um, I reached. I reached from morning still, but I was really tired because last night we went to send Tash off. So she's leaving tomorrow. So we just went to just chill. A little quiet. Not really quiet, but it's a, it's like a little chill kind of vibes you know not really something that was planned we basically fried chicken and eat festival we drink chicken and all those stuff it's just small um a lot of people was there and we were just doing karaoke and talking um i'm gonna insert a clip right now Rebelling me can touch the rebel in you, and the rebel in you can touch the rebel in me. Anyway, see you later, Tash. <laughs> 
five times. Oh, no, you do this. You do it on my real face. It was lonely happy thing. I know the party is not cast as guys. The life of the party guys. Is that going? Can I pick that up? Everybody say bye, Tash. Bye, Tash. <laughs> Where am I again? Bye, Alexa. See you again in the next life, right? Winter. Bye, Alexa. What kind of next life got her? I want it. Go next life. We're not always on post the video. Uh, next season, season. Be a next season guys. Don't know what you're doing. You're coming again? No. Yes. No. Absolutely not. Stop. 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 Yeah. So that was really having fun. It was really good. Not, not gonna lie. And then after I left, I think I left like twelve o'clock, and um my alarm was set for two thirty. Well, not was, but yeah, it was because it passed. I was set for 2.30 and by the time I drop asleep, me, I have problem falling asleep. So if I left Tash around 11.30 to 12 o'clock, that means say I had to go home, get prepared for bed because I had to brush my teeth and all those stuff. Because I don't like to go to bed without brush my teeth. And then I had to fall asleep. And I have a problem falling asleep. Like I have to do. Sometimes I have to be counting sheep. Like literally. Like I <laughs> literally snug and like lie down and say. What if this work? And then I cut one, two, three. Literally. That's how bad it is for me falling asleep. So I didn't fall asleep same time. And by the time I closed my eyes. The alarm frightened me. And to how frightened I was. I was actually shaking. I don't know. Have you ever like um, woken out of your sleep just suddenly? That was how I felt. I was just shaking. Anyhow, yeah. And then the flight. Um, so I woke up 12.30 and I bid the night that same time. So I didn't bother to shower when I was going to the airport because we barely sleep, right? So I, I knew that I wanted to leave 3 o'clock. So I woke up 3.30, grab out my clothes, brush my teeth, do a day for facial. And then left out five minutes after three because we were waiting for the car to you know warm up so that we can take the the um the snow off and it is like a hour and 40 minutes away from the airport the drive was longer than the flight to where i am nagala and the flight wasn't bad um we were delayed for a little bit but it wasn't bad going taking off in the snow the first time i'm ever flying through snow I was kind of nervous because I'm like, what if the wing freeze? <laughs> you know, what if something freeze? And they defrost the plane. I we were sitting there for a long while. And then it took off. It was smooth. No hiccups, no bump. When we reached here, it was raining. So we had a little turbulence, but it wasn't bad. So the flight wasn't bad. The worst part of the flight was the guy that was um, in my room. And he was just keep, he keep, he kept moving, so he was just shaking every minute. But I had space in between me because the flat wasn't full. Um, and I reached here to eight. Yeah, I landed to to eight, and then I came here. And I'm you know, trying to get some sleep, but every minute before I go off, every minute somebody asks me a question either on on Telegram or Instagram about the program. Uh, you know, they're going through the visa process and they're asking me a question. Or uh, my phone just ringing. Like, I'm literally just sit down, lie down here saying that we finally get we can lie down. And my phone is always on silent, but it's on vibrate. And, and I ignore the first ring and I just see that it just keep ringing. And I'm like, if the person is ringing so much time, that means it's important. So, yeah. Anyhow, I'm going to continue with the Saturday trend by reading the first question. Not the first comment, but the comments that's on here um, by this time, right? So anything after this, I won't read. But everything before this, I'm going to read and respond to your comments. I learned something from um, the Taylor's family. And I honestly don't keep up with the, 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 
a lot of rules and regulation of YouTube. But I was on their live one day and they were like, um, don't watch back your videos. There's an with, easy solution for people. With the same account. So, boom, but then that's so much, really. Oh, two weeks ago, because I'm like, what? Then that's so much comments I have to respond to. Wow. This is because I got you 60 comments. I was like, you know what? Mm -hmm. I right, said, so we have 10 comments. So, I'm going to start off with the one at the bottom. It's not in any order, guys. So, yeah. So, my name is Kerry Palmer. Maybe pretty soon TikTok will be not available in the USA. I heard about the band and <laughs> ironically though, I'm like, it's either here or there to me anymore because it's not like me have me account of the app before. Like I was so close to 10,000 and I was looking forward to making more money on TikTok. But right now it's not even here or there to me because I'm at 100 again. And I can't really talk back in but it's just, you know, I have other priorities now. Um, Chin say hey, hey yeah. <laughs> Alright, Jaden Brown say I must say I live life afar through these videos and not start manifest till me land a visa and coming up in less than a week. Pick up yourself. That is how I want it. You know, for all those who are living through me, that you can come and experience. Not only experience in Jamaica through the videos, but come here and experience it for yourself because. I'm not going to tell you everything. Like, I'm literally not going to tell you everything. Like, everybody, me and, we, who, me and who follow or whatever, any disagreements I have and all of those stuff, I'm not going to come and talk about it. You understand? If it's a drastic, like, a very drastic um, scenario, like the past roommate that I had in in um, Mandarin, yeah, I talk about that, but I didn't give any, you know, information about the person. But, I'm not going to talk about everything, like any work-related issues as it relates to, like, if I follow to the co-worker and stuff like that. I'm not going to come here and talk about it. You understand? I want to try to show you the most, um, the, I will show you, um, what you need to know. You understand? Show you what you need to know. And not just come on here and talk about any or anything and because I'm looking views, I'm going to bring down somebody here, bring down, you get me and say, yeah, we're not going to do that around here. So Jolie Kelly say, we miss you, Tash. Yes, she understood this assignment. She understood the assignment. Judy, I said Jody. <laughs> Judy Kelly, you understood the assignment. Big up yourself. Kerry said, Big up yourself, Ashley. The hairstyle look amazing, doesn't it? It look good. She go on with herself. She go on with herself, you know? She go on with herself. Even though I would change the stone here, I can't okay, believe it. Turn it up too much. Turn it up too much. This is this is what happened when you buy the pre um done here because they use the cheap here. But nevertheless, I can use mousse and revive it. But it still look good though. Still look good, right? Still look good, okay. All right, hairstyle neat, Judy Kelly. Yeah, it neat. Me not like it neat with you. Me like it. And it, hey, she do it tight, you know. So you know, say now nah, move, you know, it tight. Yeah, Judy again. Give off the piece soup. <laughs> I don't mean. I don't think it's it. Lord Jesus, pick up yourself, Judy. All right, so going back to um, Jenny, I won't lie. I look forward to you every week and I just have to say, I see the growth in your channel. Continue posting. You got this. By the way, road to 5K. You know, many if you do that, put road to 5K up at the top so people don't say that is the goal. Yeah, road to 5K. That's where we're going, right? And then sooner or later, yeah, 10K, no? sooner or later, no? 15K, no? Sooner later, you know, hundred, you know, sooner later, one million, you know, yeah. And then, you know, the channel will shift because I'm not always up on H2B. But, you know, yes, I guess people gravitate into me not only because of the H2B program, but also because of my personality. Yeah, you know, one day I was at work and a girl, um, you know, really, you know, you have those 
people at work that you don't really talk up to every day or go to them and talk about you just say hey good morning yeah this girl was just sitting there and every man I go in and say good morning and if they don't say good morning say, you know hear me I say good morning you know hear me say good morning and they respond and so forth so um I was just passing by and then the girl was like stop 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 come here so I said like Jesus I want know and then you had the other person sitting beside her and she was like um I must tell you that you have a very good personality. Don't change. Like, I really admire you. You never yet pass that as a good morning. And you know, I really, really, hey, hey, God smart. Huh? God smart, brother. God know when you need certain encouragement in your life. Because that day, I needed that. I honestly needed that. And I was like, thank you. Because I should, should not even realize what she do. You get what I mean? I say? Some people don't know what they might do, you know. When they come to certain, whenever you get a word or you have a tug for your heart and you say, yo, I got to say something to somebody, say it because sometimes God is leading you to the person. You could have saved somebody from committing suicide, save somebody from going crazy just by just opening your mouth and say a positive word. So that day I needed that and I got it and I was like, thank you. And then the other person confirmed and say, yes, it's true. You know, you have a very good personality. Don't change. Mm. she was there so then now she never yet pass and say good morning as much as we don't talk a lot or whatever whatever but she have a very good person i'm like mm -hmm. i'm very humbled yeah so dj put um music big up yourself nessa you're always vibrant thank you um judy hey judy just said don't know the comment drop them out just don't know the comment section in that <laughs> hello who is here me reach vp in the house big up yourself <laughs> yeah so that's that honestly not even know that video they did stay in because we try we try the video there because you realize you get it up until friday yeah you got it up until friday every day i put in there monday from sunday no from saturday sunday every day was in it and last week busy it was really busy because i had to be planning trip the work was busy um do send enough um get together and all those stuff and then i was working on my ebook so guys yes working on my ebook i'm gonna see if i can finish it now and then send it out whenever you see this ebook guys if you know anybody that is beneficial to it send the link to them and them bite i'm going to try my best to make it as affordable matter of fact i'm going to make it affordable it now cost me nothing you understand free yeah i'm gonna make it affordable and i'm gonna try to see if i can meet everybody where they at. meaning even though i have the one book that have everything i'm gonna dissect it so that it can suit your need yeah so yeah thank you <laughs> anyway um I'm going to just watch some telly and relax later on the shower and yeah see you tomorrow let's see what happens tomorrow but honestly I don't plan to go out I don't plan to go anywhere that cause me I am planning to me as well back my, on the money and I'm gonna leave in like less than a month and I'm gonna spend a whole lot of money because I have to be shipping box like guys <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. Like, honestly, I don't want to talk about it. So, when that bridge comes, we're going to cross it. You understand me, girl? <laughs> Whoa, I want to... Listen, listen. But, honestly, I really enjoyed J Peak. Now that you all know. Yeah, because you're that seated away. I really enjoyed J Peak. Reason being, the people that was there. The people that was there made it enjoyable. The money no good. The money no good none at all. The, the work would have stressed you out. What the fuck? It not really stress me out. I don't mean stress you out. But the money is... Like every fortnight, we are get $1,000. The most I ever gotten are $1,200. Like after tax. $1,200 after tax. And it can still stop a gap. You understand? But... I didn't get to save the amount of money that I want to save. You understand? I basically left live from aunt to mouth there because I had to be buying stuff because you know you're in a new state and you need stuff as it relates to winter gears and so forth. I have most of my family celebrate birthday during the winter. 
<laughs> you understand? Um, rent and other stuff. So I barely say nothing. So that's that. But stay tuned. Yeah, stay tuned. I'm going to definitely share that journey with you. But I really enjoyed J Peak. The house was good. The people was good to me. And yeah, it's just a pay. If it wasn't a pay, like if we were getting like probably at maybe five hundred or more when I come back. And I'm not going to say that I wouldn't come back. I would. I would come back because I was really content this season. Very content. It's just the money. Like even though Virginia I got to save some money, right? With Virginia, like I had to be relying on Uber and then I had to be cleaning the house alone with the holy pop like I had to be setting rules and it it, it just it was okay. You understand? Um I don't know, housing is everything. You know me, I chat too much. I chat too much. So I'm going to go and watch some TV and then shower later. So, I am back. Yes, I am back. And I'm going to look for Ashley. It's been a minute. Yeah. <laughs> Ashley, you don't miss me because. The odd that's the girl that doesn't walk past me. The 20. No one. I know you are nothing about that. So anybody want to go on that? I'm going to go on that. 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 Good morning, guys. So I never miss. I don't be. I never miss. I'm not out here every day. Where am I from, Mister Seth? It's who uh, give love bomb. I who love you. Yes, sir. See, Ashley, I'm up here and nails and bag of things. What's it? Ah, design. You can't go do my own. Yeah, man. What's <laughs> it? When I look so. <coughs> Shashi, not the camera. Because <laughs> I have a date. The hot date. <laughs> Bye. What's up? We don't start that shit. Smell the perfume.
cool, but tonight I'm whining I'ma be In a dangerous mood, can you match my timing? Mm-hmm. Telling me That you're really about it, why you hide it? Talk is cheap, so show me That you understand how I like it In a Walmart now, and said today is my last shop, and my budget is hundred dollars. But due to all, it is more than a hundred dollars because the car does look high. <laughs> Girl, it's high. Let me show you. What the fuck is not only me, my stuff in there. The person who drive me here, I have stuff in there. Like why? Why? Why you fuck up my car like this? Why? The people them say it's not my stuff. Okay, it's not mine. But this is the last shop. Look, boxes by. Yeah, ready for the part. What we need to eat. What else we need to buy? Apple. Yeah, we need apple petrol. Yeah. So just an update is still. <laughs> it's just so. I'll let you know how much the cost is. Yeah, but we're buying small amounts and stuff like that. I probably said 200 dollars. Let's see. I told you. Look. 200 dollars Couple pennies away. <laughs> supposed to be never, so supposed to be never print the receipt. Oh then what I see that it doing. I don't have to. Alright, guys, so, um, this is the end of the vlog. Yeah, nothing really go on in uh, this vlog. And we just never want um to vlog my traveling because I know it's not everything if you put by internet. So, yeah, let's just keep that there. You understand? But um, back to regular scheduling. I'm gonna see how best we can edit this video because I know I'm not really start yet. I uh, just got in from Walmart and I'm going to pack out the stuff them and so forth and probably season this the stuff the meat them tomorrow. This is the final shopping guys. Um I I'd said that I wanted to do like one hundred dollars budget, but you know what? After going there and picking up stuff and re re realizing that I need stuff for lunch and I need to get the boxes and all those stuff and the back the suction bag thing I was like you know what $200 and as you can see that my bill was $199 and I think it would have reached the $200 if the can drink never drop on burst but nevertheless yeah I saved pennies <laughs> So that's it for now, the final spending. And the reason why I spend um, that much in groceries because I don't have like a date yet that um, I plan in my head to go to the place. And then even when the person, the employer call me and said that they're ready, they have to give me ample time. You understand? So if I know that, um, say for instance, they call me this week and I have food that can last me until next week. I want to say, yo, wait until next week. You get me? Yeah. And I bought the box. I'm going to start packing. I don't know when I'm leaving it, but I'm going to start packing because I don't want anything, everything to pile along on me. And I bought flame wrap. Well, anyway, stay tuned for that. I'm going to, um show you how I pack so that you guys can pack with me when you have so much stuff like I do and even if you don't have so much stuff and you want to like travel light because I like to travel light yeah so that's that so this is the end of the vlog thank you for watching and um share with your friends and family and join me on this journey yeah we're almost out of here and we're almost into summer. So stay tuned for all of that. And big up all on a nice clean self. And if you reach this final, um, subscribe. Like, we are fun, subscribe. Subscribe. Like. And if you reach this final, like, like, we are we fun. Like, like. Yeah. Drop down in down below Walmart. Let me see if I know. Let me see if I know watch it. Drop Walmart in the comment. Alright. Peace and love. Bye.